so hi guys how are you in this today's video i will show you how you can customize your terminal actually my one subscriber has requested me to make this video as here you can see i have guided him fully in discord here you can see i have fully guided him discord but in today's video i will show you how you can customize your terminal as here you can see my terminal so uh, from different it is different from normal terminal as we see uh, as here you can see uh, guys so much customization in this today's video i will show you how you can customize in your terminal if i type ls clear you can customize more than better than me if you want so let's uh, let's start our video at present okay guys whatever we will do uh, at present i am in my kali linux this is kali linux at present uh, i am showing you as here you can see kali linux uh, whatever we will do do it here and i will uh, do it at my virtual box because uh, i have already customized my uh, host machine as here you can see this is my host machine and this is my uh, uh, this is my kali linux newly guys this kali linux is fully newly installed kali linux here you can see i have installed uh, just now few minutes ago only i have installed this kali linux here you can see and one more guys i have guided this guy the name he is joined with the name professor i have uh, guided this guy uh, you can if you want if you get any error you can uh, say me in discord i will try to solve out your problem there as here you can see i have uh, fully guided this guy uh, this name professor whatsoever uh, let's start our video first what you have to do uh, your terminal will uh, okay first you subscribe my channel and here you can see i am in my kali so to customize your terminal what you have to do first you have to install some package for that type this command sudo apt install zsh here you can see this guys this command sudo apt install zsh press enter give the password of your user and here you can see ZSS, ZSS is already pre installed comes pre installed in Kali. Here you can see. First, you have to install this package ZSH. Now, what you have to do? Go back to your uh, browser. Here, I am using by default Firefox. It comes by default. It is taking time to load. Guys, one minute. As here you can see, Firefox has been uh, loaded out. And in the uh, in the search bar, search uh, oh my zsh. Okay, I am opening one more tab, searching in the Google section. I am searching oh my zsh. And here you can see, guys, oh my zsh. Come to the official website. This one. Sorry. This here you can see oh my ZSH a delightful and open source framework for ZSH. This can this you can check out the URL also. I will give the link in description. Here you can see https oh my z dot sh. Come to this URL. Uh, now you have to scroll down a little bit. Little bit scroll down. And here you can see install oh my ZSH. This line. Here you can see you can install oh my zsh by curl also by wget also curl and wget are both are the pre uh, pre installed packages in uh, kali linux if you doesn't install curl and wget for how to install it type this command apt sudo apt install curl and wget type these two commands your curl and wget will be installed okay now move to your firefox come to curl and copy from sh to here copy this one from here to here this sh still copy this one move back to your terminal and paste it as here you can see press enter it will automatically install it as here you can see oh my zhs has been installed let's restart our terminal as here you can see oh my zhs has installed in few commands only okay guys now our work has not completed now only zsh has been installed now also some work is left 
uh now we have to install our themes yes themes for zsh and plugins some plugins because uh by default if you say uh, if i type l f dex then here you can see no suggestion by default as here you can see my in my terminal here you can see uh, the color changing and the default changing the here you here you will not get if we have to do some changes on this one for that come back to your firefox open one new tab and search uh, oh my zsh sorry zsh of themes t h e m e and here you can see oh my zhs themes guys oh my zsh comes with some pre installed theme also and uh, external uh, themes also guys here you can see so 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 many of themes are there download uh, you choose your favorite theme as i am scrolling down uh, for a bit uh, here many themes are there many themes as here you can see which one you uh, feel better like that you choose that one here many themes are there so many themes guys uh, my favorite theme is uh, this one this two let me to show you my one of the favorite theme is uh, this one and one of the favorite theme is this one one minute and uh, this one af magic this theme this is th this these two are my favorite themes i which i normally use uh, for changing the themes what you have to do go back to your terminal as here you can see i am in my terminal now type nano uh, okay don't use nano use any text editor i am using mousepad for my uh, flexibility <laughs> uh, then you have to give this sign what is uh, then you have to type dot zsh rc you have to type this command okay and after typing this command here you can see one manual has been opened and in the line number 11 here you can see zsh theme here robuster this is written now uh, remove this robuster and make sure you doesn't open this one with root shell guys if you want to change your uh, root terminal make sure you should be in your root uh, directory i am doing it for my normal user that why i am not using sudo make sure that if you are uh, if you want to change your root terminal then you have to log in with uh, sorry root uh, account okay and in the root folder we have to do changes if you are do, if you want to do with root as here you can see i am in my normal account that's why i am doing uh, without sudo make sure you also do without sudo and here you can see line number 11 you have to, uh, by default yes some uh, zsh theme uh, he by default this one will be there now what you have to do uh, rub this rob uh, this spelling robuster or whatever written rub this one and move back to your firefox browser and choose your favorite theme which you want to use i want to use uh, consider i want to use this angnoster then what i will do come to your mouse pad in, in line number 11 zss theme paste this one and save it now cross it out move back to your terminal cross your terminal also and open a new terminal and here you can see guys sorry 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 our terminal theme has been changed if i type ls neo fetch uh okay cat at c os release as here you can see uh, some uh, the theme of our terminal has been changed if you want to change this this theme also then what you have to do move back to your terminal and choose any of the name here you can see i am uh, now think i want to consider to use this afolar or i want okay i want to use this af magic theme copy this name move back to your terminal type nano this sign then sorry this sign then dot zs rc now in line number 
guys in the previous uh, previous i have shown i have opened with mousepad this time i am opening with mouse uh, nano now uh, in the zss theme in the line number 11 here you have to paste that uh, that name of the theme and here you can see then control plus o now save it now uh, now close our terminal and open a new terminal let's see as here you can as here you can see our theme has again changed changed as here you can see our theme has been changed till now we, uh, now like this you can uh, try out any theme here so many themes are uh, given here you try out your uh, favorite ones which one you like and if you want this apple theme you can try out this one also try try out which one you like as as you mm. and now what we have to do now we have to install oh my zhs plugins for that what you have to type oh my zsh auto suggestion Yes, here you can see one uh, file zsh auto suggestion install dot m m d at uh, this this link. Come to this link. As here you can see in this link, I will give the link in description also. Make sure you check out this uh, description. And here you can see uh, if you scroll little bit more down, then here you can see oh my zhs. First, what we have to do? Clone this repository. For that, click on this button or Control A. Sorry, or copy this one everything, or click on this button. Then move back to your terminal and paste it. Then hit Enter. Then you here you will see one uh, theme will be downloaded. Not now. What we have to do? Now we have to do some changes on ZSH RC file. We have to uh, add this pl plugin name. For that. Uh, this time I will use mousepad, mousepad, uh, then uh, slash dot zsh rc this file, and here you can see our zsh file has been opened. If you you have to scroll down, scroll down, scroll down, and you have to find out this line, line number seventy three. Here you can see plugin section is going to get. One default plugin you here it is given. Press enter. Uh, sorry, uh, give some space and uh, and copy this uh, name. ZSH Auto Suggestions. As here you can see, uh, I have copy pasted this name. Mm. Uh, plugin section. Now save it. Make sure you save it now. Cross it out. Move back to your terminal. Cross it. Let's zoom our terminal. As here you can see, guys. Now some auto suggestion is giving. Here you can see this suggestion. This is that suggestion. If you uh, rewind this video, then here you will see. Whenever uh, before also we have typed this comment. That time suggestion has not given, but now it is giving. Why? Because we have installed this plugin. For this plugin, this auto suggestion has been given. Okay. Uh, now we have to install one more plugin of OMIZSH, and make sure if you get any problem, uh, you can say me in uh, Discord server also, or you can try. Uh, okay, nothing more. Now we have to install one more plugin. For that, O oh my ZSH uh, auto complete. Syntax, guys. One minute. Uh, let me to open one Discord. I have guided this guy. Uh, I have forget it, but we have installed. Once let me to check it out. Auto suggestion. Okay, ZSS syntax highlighter. 
now we will install one more uh, uh, plugin with the name of ZSH syntax highlighter here you can see oh my ZSH syntax highlighter I think the first link here you can see ZSI syntax highlighter install.md I will give the all I will give all the links in description also here you can check it out if we scroll a little bit more down yes this 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 sorry this repository only come to this uh, repository scroll a little bit more down here you can see oh my ZHS clone this repository now what we have to do uh, copy this command oh my zsh copy this command or click on here it will copy it automatically paste it on your terminal and here you can see it is done now what you have to do type this command mousepad slash dot zsrc you can use any text editor but i am using mousepad come to line number 73 here you can see plugins section plugins is equal to get now uh, at the last here you have to give some space and uh, paste this name this name one minute zsa syntax highlighter paste this name now save it I have saved it now close our terminal and once more again we open it zoom it little bit and here you can see if we type ls f uh, f dix then here you can see the color is changing if you uh, rewind this video then you will see uh, it is at first it is showing white white color it is not looking so cool now the color has been changing of this terminal if I type echo subscribe uh, okay tick. No. let's check color has been changing or not yes uh, guys here you can see the color has been changed and our terminal is looking like uh, looking uh, very cool like an hacker yes yes guys like an hacker as here you can see uh, nothing more you can install additional plugins also but these two plugins are the uh, most important uh, uh, very useful plugins that's why I have shown uh, and from here you can check out these themes also I will give all the links in description as here you can see and nothing more uh, here you can see your terminal has been customized also uh, subscribe my channel and follow me in my social media join my discord server nothing else goodbye tata take care